Good morning, good afternoon and good evening to all Denarians on the go and in the know. Today is November 30, 2019. Get your free trial copy of the new CEP, Currency Exchange Planner. Rated the number one exchange planner by Denarians for Denarians for both pre and post RV planning. The link is in the description below. Simply fill out the form and an email will be sent to you with the download link. I encourage you, knowledge is power, stay informed and stay alert, and know, we all cross the finish line together. First article of interest, Abdul Mahdi's resignation is now in force. Legal expert, 45 days separating us from the new government. Legal expert Eric Harb said on Saturday that the resignation of Prime Minister Adel Abdul Mahdi does not need the approval of the House of Representatives and is effective as of today, while noting that the Constitution gave a 45-day deadline to choose a new government. Harb told al that the resignation of Abdul Mahdi and his government does not need the approval of the Parliament and is effective as of today, especially after he signed the resignation of his ministers to Parliament until a new government is elected. He added, the deputies gave 45 days to initiate the President of the Republic to assign the largest bloc to nominate a new Prime Minister, pointing out that the President of the Republic is not obliged to assign a certain bloc, but the largest bloc nominated Abdul Mahdi previously. Prime Minister Adel Abdul Mahdi called on his cabinet members to continue their work until a new government is formed. It is noteworthy that an informed source said that the Council of Ministers approved the resignation of the Secretary General of the Council Hamid al Ghazi and Director of the Office of Prime Minister Abu Jihad al Hashemi. Next article of interest KRG delegation to visit Baghdad Sunday for talks on budget, says Minister Suleimani. A delegation from the Kurdistan region will visit Baghdad on Sunday, December 1. For talks about the 2020 federal budget, a senior official has said. Kurdistan Regional Government, KRG, Minister of State Khalid Shwani told reporters on Saturday that the delegation will hold talks with the Federal Ministry of Finance about the region's share of the budget, which currently stands at 12.67%. Regarding the resignation of Prime Minister Adil Abdul Mahdi, Shwani said the Kurdistan region makes agreements with the government not a specific person. All of our attempts are to make the understandings between the region and Baghdad reach a final agreement, he added. Abdul Mahdi submitted his letter of resignation to the Council of Representatives on Saturday and later called on the parliament to find an alternative as soon as possible as the country does not go through any power vacuum. The KRG and the federal government reached an agreement last week to resolve their ongoing disagreement over oil. Minister of Oil Thay Mergadbin said the KRG had agreed to export 250,000 barrels of oil per day through Baghdad to Turkey's Sehan next year. Oil is just one of several persistent disagreements between the two governments, which also includes security and the disputed areas. Coordinator of the Council of Representatives Finance Committee Ahmed Safar said on Wednesday that Baghdad is expected to send nearly 1 trillion Iraqi dinars. $838 $838 million per month to the Kurdistan region in 2020 after Baghdad and Erbil reached an agreement over oil exports and the budget. Next article of interest. Kurdistan region on the resignation of Abdul Mahdi. We are negotiating with the government and not people. The spokesman for the Kurdistan regional government, Goudir Adel, Saturday on the submission of Prime Minister Adel Abdul Mahdi resignation to the House of Representatives, while noting that the Kurdistan regional government is negotiating with the Iraqi government and not with people. Adel was speaking during a seminar on the proposed amendments to the Iraqi constitution in the city of Suleimanu attended by Slash Mawazain News Slash that the current Iraqi constitution is the best so far noting that the Kurdistan regional government believes that Iraq has never had a better constitution than the current constitution and that if the constitution is to be amended, it is necessary to observe the principle of consensus. On the fate of the negotiations between Erbil and Baghdad, after Abdul Mahdi announced his intention to resign, the spokesman said, Let us not anticipate events, 
We are aware of the situation in Iraq. Let us wait and see the functioning of the mechanisms provided for by the Constitution. He added, We are firm on our position and will not change. We are negotiating with the Iraqi government and not people and our goal is to agree with the Iraqi government to ensure the rights of the people of Kurdistan in accordance with the Iraqi Constitution. Next article of interest. The National Axis supports the resignation of Abdel Mahdi and calls on the remaining presidencies to follow in his footsteps. The National Axis, Saturday, approved the step of Prime Minister Adel Abdel Mahdi to resign from his post. The coalition said in a statement received, Mawazi News, that, in the critical circumstances and accelerating events in the Iraqi street and with the escalation of the number of martyrs who fell while calling for their rights, there must be a sincere pause and a serious position to restore the situation and put an end to the country's disintegration to what do not praise his heels. He added, the National Axis Alliance, in support of the step taken by Mr. Adel Abdul Mahdi to resign, it demands the rest of the presidencies to be brave enough to submit their resignation, because everyone was a partner in this situation. We believe that the dissolution of Parliament is a step and a prelude to a new phase in which everyone has a responsibility to protect and reconcile the country, he said. Next article of interest, Delegation of the Kurdistan Region, Our Dialogues with State Institutions and Not Personalities and We Will Visit Baghdad Tomorrow. The resignation of Prime Minister Adel Abdul Mahdi from his post will not affect the course of the ongoing negotiations on the draft budget law confirming a visit to the capital Baghdad on Sunday. The Prime Minister has submitted his resignation and we should not anticipate the events and wait for what happened, Regional Minister Khalid Shwani said in a press statement. He added that, We will visit Baghdad tomorrow and we will meet with the Iraqi parties in order to reach a final agreement on the budget law and go to submit its draft law to the House of Representatives for approval. Be sure and hit the like and subscribe button to be alerted on new news as it unfolds from Iraq. Don't forget to grab your free trial copy of the CEP, Currency Exchange Planner, the number one must-have tool, for the currency exchange for both pre- and post-RV planning, the link is in the description box below. Stay informed and stay alert, knowledge is power, more articles of interest to come, over and out for now, the Denarian.